Hi, I'm Dr. Steve Grinstead, author of the book Freedom from Suffering, A Journey of Hope, and someone living with my own chronic pain and thriving for the last 32 years. Today I want to talk about how do you take care of yourself when you're away from home and you have to practice pain management. Yesterday and today I'm in Los Angeles, California presenting trainings for the Board of Registered Nursing here in California. And yesterday I noticed about halfway through the day that my back pain started to flare up. Now this time it was a quick trip so I didn't carry my usual travel bag so I didn't have my TENS unit with me, I didn't have some of the ointment, the gel that I use and fortunately one of the other people there had some with her and lent it to me. In addition to that I went last night, I soaked in the hot tub after we got done with the day, stretched really well. This morning I got up early, went for a swim and then went for a walk and practiced all the things that I would while I was at home. So, but I had to accommodate, I had to do it in a different setting. I also needed to really get into what I'm grateful for and to change my attitude. So when people have a pain flare-up, a lot of times they get so busy focusing on the pain and leading to what I call suffering that instead of this pain, oh, this hurts, it's, man, it's horrible, it's killing me, it's awful, it's terrible. And I fortunately haven't had to do that for almost 30 years, you know. And I believe that freedom from suffering is every pain patient's right. And I also believe it's a responsibility. So I needed to be responsible, be proactive, get into action, and do all the things I know that can help me work through a pain flare-up without it disrupting my quality of life. I was able to do my presentations yesterday. I was able to go and have an, a wonderful, relaxing business dinner with a 13 other people from the program last night. This morning, I was able to do my routine of exercise and stretching, have a great brief breakfast meeting with some of the participants, and now I'm getting ready again to do what I love most, teach other people how to help people. And I'm very excited and want you to keep tuning back because there's a great stuff coming up with Freedom From Suffering in the near future. There's going to be a lot more ways to interact with me and my group than ever before. And please keep coming back and checking in. And remember, it's only one day at a time. And my favorite Sanskrit proverb that I got into this morning, today well lived, makes every yesterday a dream of happiness, and every tomorrow a vision of hope. And today I have hope. Thank you.